Hi there, this is Peter Zoe from the House of Fans um, coming with another unboxing video. Um, so this time of year is a like, really good time for um, South American imports. So we have like a lot of really cool um, Playcos. So I want to start with these guys. These are the false zebra Playcos. So it's a little hard to see in the blue bag, but you can kind of get an idea of all the colorations on these guys. Um, this is a hypencistrus species, so these guys are going to be a little bit more fond of meat, um, so these aren't going to really be like a, a, an algae eating Playco. Um, so these are probably one of the least expensive um, hypencistrus species that you can get, but they're still really, really colorful, cool little fish. Um, and eventually if you get good at keeping these, maybe you could try doing the actual zebra Playcos. We're going to go into another Playco. These guys I think we highlight a lot, but they're always a lot of fun. These are the green phantom Playcos. Really easy fish to take care of. They get quite large. Here's another one of those green phantom Playcos, a little bit larger size. So that guy's pretty neat. Alright, so we'll go away from the Playcos for a minute. And then this is just the classic platy. Um, these are the green lantern platys. Um, a lot of cool colors in these guys, really dig this fish. Great little community tank, um, resident. So you can keep a little colony of these guys in 10 gallon tanks and larger. Um, and great little fish to mix with all sorts of different community type fish. So we'll do a couple of oddballs. This is a Burmese clouded archer. These guys are actually a true freshwater fish. Um, freshwater archer, a lot of the more common ones that we see in the hobby are going to be more um, estuary or brackish water or even going into full marine. But these guys come from Myanmar um, and they are really, really far up in true freshwater environments. So it might be a little hard to get an idea of these guys, but they'll be neat when they're all set up in their tank. These are the leopard tenopomas. Look how cute they are, they're so tiny. Let's see if we can get them all into one corner. So, these guys are adorable when they're babies. They get enormous. Um, you expect adults to be in that like five to six inch range. But actually a relatively peaceful fish, as long as there's not anything that they can fit into their mouth, they are definitely predatory ambush predators. Um, so any fish that is small enough to fit in their mouth, they definitely will. But at this size, you can get away with keeping them with most things, um, but just because they're predatory doesn't mean they're necessarily aggressive, so they will be, you know, um, intimidated by like cichlids and things like that, so definitely um, make these guys the star of the show. Alright guys, so that's it, that's all we have for you today. Um, we do have loads more fish in this week, but this is just a little taste of some of the cooler things that uh, I wanted to highlight for you. Thanks so much.